Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Mega Modded series. I'm jumping in again as our good piggy boy. I very much love playing as this guy, so I'm going to go for it. And we're going to get some extras to start the run. Because I like to have a few extra keys or a loot engine, whatever the hell that is. Um, oh god. I've got a burp brewing. I've just started drinking some coke and it's, it's not good. Anyways, let's see uh, exactly what our items do here. And have a good old time. Have a good old time indeed. A little bit late on the episode here. It should have been up yesterday, but I got busy with things. The Tuesday episode slot is... Eh. <laughs> Doesn't always come out when it should. But let's not worry about that too much. Anyways, let's take a look at what we got going on here. So, we got the loot engine. Rerolls all consumables in a room into other consumables. Intriguing. This could be pretty good. We also got killing enemy refills your gun's clip slightly reduces reload time. That also sounds real heckin' good. Um, and then I can't remember how this thing works. We'll just find out, I guess. Okay, this thing's good. But killing an enemy, refilling your clip sounds kind of bonkers in my opinion um and will probably lead to some really really heckin' good stuff although apparently the electricity killing enemy doesn't count so that's not great <laughs> uh let's go back to our shorty for now then because the shorty is actually pretty damn good we can save the um electricity thing for the boss as well because we might want to use it for that anyways Excuse me, how did I not hit you there? Oh, killing this guy for me. Oh my lord, that was so foolish of me right there. For some reason, I saw this guy and just didn't pay any attention to him. I just decided it would be best to ignore him completely. Very much a foolish gambit on my behalf. Um, but we push on, we push on. Now, we do have enough to obviously open that chest there, but a brown chest, considering all crates, all chests even, cost the same amount. Not a great way to spend your money, to be honest. Um, you could get a key out of it too, which gives you some stuff back. Um, we'll have a look at that. That's actually really good to get on the first floor, because you're probably likely to get a key kin. We could get a bonus key, which is quite a lot of bonus money. Uh, also, we need to remember to use the loot engine here and there. Um... There's a key there. Oh, because this works on the looty boys too. So, let me kill this guy real quick first here. If he's ever going to die. I'm going to grab that key. Oh, hello. What the fuck? I realise I just lost a lot of money there on the floor. Because I didn't realise this guy was here. But the key bullet kin kind of confused me there. That was all very confusing. Now, if I loot engine this A, there you go, into some armor. Didn't need the ammo particularly, so... Oh, for God's sake, I'm getting hit so much right now. I could do with getting hit a lot less than I currently am. This room itself is just kind of horrible. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff going on in here. Also, the shotgun not doing a great job of killing these guys. Yeah. Not seeing many sacks on the floor, but our money's looking good, despite having lost a good bit of it to getting hit a few times there. Nice. I'm just going to hold out here until those go away. Drop me a sack, you fool. Um, I think this is a really good contender for our loot engine here, but I think think the blanks get stolen i'm gonna i'm gonna gamble on this i i don't think they do we'll open that up oh bollocks this is awful i'm gonna lose all of my money here okay no that actually wasn't so bad i didn't lose too much and we get ourselves the t45 gtr fires mini rockets towards an inbuilt targeting system reloading a full clip to lock on uh to the currently targeted enemies interesting Definitely not something we want to be using on controller, sadly. Um, but we'll see how this goes. 
Oh wait, no, it auto locks on. Good. Okay, no. This. Okay, unfortunately, this is um. <laughs> Kind of doo doo stinky on controller. Oh my god, this is so hard to control. <laughs> this is not built with controller in mind at all. Really? I mean, it got some HP, so that's not bad. Yeah, this thing on controller, it don't heckin it don't heckin work very well. It kind of auto aims onto enemies, but then as soon as I fire, it removes the lock on. Like, it locks on there, look, but then it just removes the lock on, and I'm not really sure why. Okay, let's try and do it like that, shall we? Gotta do the extra reload. There we go, boom, and that locks the lock on. Okay, that's probably gonna work a bit better for me. I'm probably just using it wrong. I still, it's not, not good on controller regardless here. There's a sack over there, I see it. I should really just try and migrate back over to PC controls because it just would help with modding in general, but eh. Oh, hello. Um. It's been a while since I've seen you, Secret Room. It's been a while. It's been a long time without you, my friend. Um. Heavy bullets, nice. Right, leave all this stuff in here for now, I think. Oh wait, let's open this chest as well. Uh, yeah, let's leave all that stuff in there for now, and I'll come back to you in a moment. Let's use this for now here. Okay, this weapon is doing a very good amount of damage here. I like it. Hey, there you go. Very easy kill on you. Lovely. Right, up to a good amount of money here. We also get another bullet mod. Backwards bullets, which is, yeah, pretty much exactly what I hoped, uh, hoped it wouldn't be. Which, again, is another thing that works really poorly on controller. Um, yeah, let's let's try it. Let's, let's give it a go. Right. So. I think we want to go boom. It didn't work. It was supposed to reroll junk and stuff. It's what it said it did. Maybe it's because it's like set. It doesn't work. Okay, let's just pick it up. Let's talk to you. Give me a cleaver of some kind. Interesting. And then we shall take this. And then I think I can just corrupt all of this again. Oh, it fucking came up my back. God damn it. Can't I kill you now? Is that not the whole point of the corrupted thing? I can't remember. Um. I'm gonna gamble here and feed this in because I can't really use it. And the meat cleaver. I don't know. Potentially better. Right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of skadoodle. I got a good amount of money here. Now this thing doesn't actually fire backwards, which is intriguing. Just gets the big stat upgrade and makes it really, really good. Okay, the whip's going to be real, real hot for us right now. Um, let's do this, shall we? God damn it, Barrel. Why are you going to be this way? Oh my god, I'm not fast enough for this thing. This is so infuriating. Just go where I want you to go. 
It's not going to do it. I can't, I can't get it to go where I want it to go. I just need to move slightly over to the right. Very slightly over to the right. Okay, there you go. That's it. We're good, we're good. No, no, don't go over there. Where has it gone? I've lost it. I can't fucking see it! Shit sake, where's it gone? There you go. That was a pain in the ass. Right, away we go. This has been something else. This has been quite stressful already. But yeah, honestly, I'm probably just going to use the whip for a good portion of this run until it kind of falls off and we find a better weapon. Because the backwards bullets, again on controller, basically it just means you lose all your aim assist because you're not looking at the enemy. So they're very hard to use. Whereas the whip seems to fire forward and yet I still gain all the stats that I would have otherwise. Like we got two shot, baby. Also, we can hit enemies behind walls. It's all good over here. It's all good. Just keep smacking at that guy. Look at that. Beautiful. Hitting basically the entire room in one go. More ammo. So many things to re-roll now that we can't re-roll them. God damn it. as well. Oh, there's a big boy. He's a big boy. Don't worry. I can deal with big boys. Love the music down here. Makes me happy. Oh, you've got a little jammy jammy going on, do you? Well, how about this? You have become corrupted, my good lads. Lightsaber as well. Oh! <laughs> I didn't expect that. Okay. That's going to be uh, a little bit spicy to use, I would say. Ah! Oh, what the hell? That fucking shot went around the wall. Scared the hell out of me. Stab at you. This thing's a beast. Holy shit, another thing. Another thing that doesn't really work well with controller. Although, ha <laughs> Okay. <laughs> this is rather peculiar. Okay, okay. We've 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 created something quite strange here. Triple crossbow, I guess. Yeah, this is this is odd. <laughs> we've got three things that all don't really work well with controller so far this run. Um created some oddities, I guess, but <laughs> We're still moving on. We're still getting on. Now, you can do some cool stuff with the corruption bombs. You can corrupt NPCs to steal from shops. You can turn things into NPCs sometimes. You get little chickies here, look. Little chickadees. What cares? We're okay, we're only on two cares so far. That's not so bad. I thought it was worse than that. God damn, the ammo drops are real right now. So many ammo drops. This whip is slapping. It's just got such crazy range. I'm not sure if it normally has this range or if the backwards thing is, is like bugging it out a little bit.
very plausible that it is. Okay, what you got for me? Brown chest, I'm going to leave for now. I might open it at, uh, later on. We'll see. Easy pickings with you. Well, this room was really something. We do have a third chest room lying around somewhere as well. Corruption bombs make everything a bit easier for us. Turned one of them into a chicken there. Oh, I think it also deletes the, the future waves of that same room as well. Honestly, this is a good room for it. Should have done that a little earlier. Ooh, he might be bugged. This is really hard to use. Yeah, he might be bugged. Double corruption. Don't really know what to do now. Is there a way to restart the room? There's definitely a command for it, but I can't remember what it is. Um, why is the garbage collector now disabled? Use command garbage collector to toggle it back on. Give me it back. Toggle. Good. Right. Um, I don't really know what to do. The game, this game doesn't have a fail save if you get stuck in a room, so... I guess I could just restart the floor. But we're quite close to the end, so I'd rather not. <gasps> Snake. The way the tables go. Damn you, goddamn fool. Why'd you have to do this? Corruption bombs. How dare you. Uh, I, I can't remember what command I'd use here. Um, and I can't even remember what the stage name for the jungle even is. So. I, can't, I, 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 I can't remember what any of the commands are. I don't know. Right, one second. Okay, we are back. Apparently it was quick underscore kill. So everything just dies instantly, and then we can just go and turn it back off again. Huzzah! We are back. We are back. So, good to know. Good to know command. I like that a lot. Stuff like that, very, very useful for fixing things when they break, which is somewhat often. No, th breaks like that don't happen that often, luckily. I'm hoping we can uh, get some good stuff from the shop here, wherever that might lie. Corruption bomb out. I know that a corruption bomb is the thing that broke it before, but I'm committed. I am committed to hopefully getting some good stuff from this. I still can't remember exactly how the corruption bomb works. It's been a while since I had one. Hey, we found this guy. Hello. We could do the advanced dragon if we really wanted to. I mean, we have three junk, so we can feed him the necessary requirements. I guess why not, to be honest. I actually can't believe the idiocy that just unfolded there. Do you see how, like, much I basically just walked directly into that shot? It was redonkulous. Dude. Why, when I'm playing this character, is it always like, do you know what would be funny if there was nothing in the shop to reroll? All the time with this bitch. 
very, very annoying. Right, um... I genuinely don't know what gun's going to be good to use here. I'm going to try these two. Alright, first of all, let's set a corruption bomb up on you. Get that slowing effect going. Probably going to lose some money here. Where are you? Oh shit, you're down at the door? I didn't know- Dude, I did not realise you could spawn there, you little shit. That was kind of evil. Okay, we got her. Not too bad, not too bad. Is that lowercase R? No, it's the Shredder. Oh, we have synergies for it too, nice. Plastic explosives. We have bird synergies for it. We have the ammo of the pit lord and heavy bullets. This thing could could end up being really good. Let's find out. Let's go and feed our dragon. Hello, good sir. Have my junk. You oh, you need one more, do you? You can have that as well. Why not? There you go. Right, let's go. Let's try this out. I'm interested to see how well the shredder performs. Also, I don't really think about the fact that heavy bullets is making our remote control better because things are moving slower. Kind of interesting. Pretty weird run. <laughs> Pretty weird run. Oh god. Um yeah, it's 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 unfortunately it might have been better if I could actually use it correctly, but I can't, so maybe it's not. I literally can't even use weapons in this room. Got to have my whip ready to to be a secondary for us. Oh my god. <clears throat> this is so boxed. Certain rooms I'm just going to have to use the whip because I, I physically can't use a gun. If the room's too small, a gun isn't going to work. <laughs> That's kind of interesting to play it like that. I'll open that straight up. Shadow bullets is fantastic. I will take that in a heartbeat. We have this shrine, which, honestly, it, the sound thing has been fixed. I s see on one, but on one half, I really want to find out what sort of stuff this thing does. But on the other half, it's going to kill me. I know it is. It's going to kill me. So it's like, do I bother? <laughs> I know that it's going to end up getting me killed because I don't understand it. But I'm never going to understand it if I don't try it. So it's kind of like, whoa, whoa, what the hell happened then? I just destroyed that chest by accident. Apparently hitting the corner of a wall with some oh, shadow bullets. Holy shit. Shadow bullets makes this thing into a tentacle monster. I kind of love that. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Shadow Ball, it says this thing is an absolute tentacle monster, and I love that. Dude, with the bullshit. I. The barter thing just literally got rid of 180 money. Give casing 180. I'm not having it take away all that money off of me. That's just absolute. Oh shit. <laughs> Can't be doing that to me, game. No thanks. Used barter once, took away all my money, and didn't reroll anything. 
Dude, the, the, I actually despise the shops in this game. Like, I know it's impossible or, like, very difficult, but I really hope one day that something in modern comes along to let people be able to change how stock in shops works. Because I, I just... Walking into a shop and it's selling nothing apart from keys, it's just like, the fuck? What's even the point? It's just no fun at all. I already have to have the money to be able to afford the things. Give me the things. I like my tentacle monster whip. It's fun. Should use my corruption bombs a little more often whenever I can, really. Like here. Ration there. We got ration randomly. Unfortunately, not really something we can utilize, but... <laughs> oh, I'm trying to think of all the items that could really break this whip. Some extra junk there. See, you can get some extra stuff sometimes. Go, oh, tentacle monster whip. That's a minigun. It's Sasha. <clears throat> this is just so bizarre. Let's see how this does the shred. Let's see how the shredder does first, actually. Virtually impossible to hit her correctly. Mainly because I don't know which side of me the fucking bullet's gonna come out of. Okay, Sashka does good damage. A lot of wee little beasties around. Very weird to use this, but it's somehow working out. Okay. Let me just try this. It's, ah, it's this thing will kill me, but I feel like I can't not take it. But this, it will be the thing that kills me this run. Because I just don't understand it. That actually does give me an item. I see. The ever warm heart um, of a great demon. Mm. Cool. And then I'll have this thing chasing me. The, I believe the sound has been fixed, so... If it isn't and my eardrums bleed, I will cry audibly. But hopefully that shouldn't be the case. Hopefully there should be no need to audibly cry. Right, back to back to our tentacle monster whip. It just can't be it can't be ignored. Oh, what the fuck? Where, did you, where the hell did you... Dude, where the hell did you come from? Okay, I managed to get most of that money back there, but that was a little annoying. It just kind of appeared behind me and I did not expect it. Luckily, we have fire immunity, so the curse of fire isn't doing too much to make me upset. While we've got this effect here going, we're killing stuff real fast. Jam snake. Okay. What I want now is scatter shot. 
I think that would really make everything here quite lovely. I don't know what it would do to the whip. It would certainly make everything else better. Damn it, still on the mushrooms. Luckily everything exploded instantly. I don't mind that. Okay, finally an item. Can it not get rid of all my money when I re-roll this time? No, it's just going to get rid of all my money when I re-roll again. Give casing 240. Reroll, unfortunately, just doesn't work at all now. That's a little upsetting. Teleport a prototype or the D chest. We also got a secret room here. It's you. Hello. Probably going to lose a lot of money in here. The webbing that I've accidentally spawned really isn't helping. Oh, God. His AI seems to be a bit boxed now because of that blank. Don't quite know what he's doing, but oh well. Got a black chest out of it that's a mimic. You're a tangler. Nice. Back to Sasha. Um. Whip. Cheeky bugger. Hey, that's not bad. I don't mind that. And what happens if I try and corrupt all the stuff on the floor? Damn, it doesn't do anything. I was hoping I could corrupt it all. Okay. Leave that there for now. Go and do some of these other rooms, I guess. <clears throat> the whip is just so fun. I heard something. There must be a sack disappearing. I suppose with all the fire, it's going to be relatively hard for me to see if they ever exist, isn't it? I'll admit I've not really been paying attention for them, but I don't think there's much hope. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, for f I, I waited! Like, a little bit of time to see if that was a Mimic. Clearly not long enough. Not even taking that to trash weapon. Actually, uh, I'll see how it works with this setup. Nah, it's, it's bad. <laughs> it's bad. Bow weapons are my most despised type of weapons. They are just so bad. <laughs> Modded or not, they're just never good. Let me see you there, little Saki. I gotcha. Don't corrupt this guy. Game won't like it. Right. Wait a sufficient amount of time. Hey, ballot's not bad. And what the hell's this room over here doing? Why is it just a single square? <laughs> What's this about? <laughs> right. Unfortunately, we're going to have to go the long way around here, I think. Actually, no, we don't have to. We don't have to. We don't have to complete every room here. Ho 
Holy shit, that was like a really crazily fast shot that he put out there. Okay. Get Sasha back out again, I think. I don't know if using the Corruption Bomb against bosses is actually worthwhile. I found a bit of a rhythm for how to hit with the Sasha more regularly. It's a little bit finicky, but I've got a kind of shoot left, shoot right, shoot left, shoot right sort of thing and hit each stream. It's really not ideal. There you go. We got him in the end. Sasha does a good job. Big iron. Oh, it's the fucking heavy iron as well. I like this. Oh, with this range though, it's bad. I will not put these items down though. I have committed to this absurdity. And I will not let it go. If I was on if I was on a PC, like if it was on, on keyboard and mouse, this wouldn't be anywhere near as bad. <laughs> but on controller remote bullets is just ass. And then backwards bullets makes it even worse. Also, I just want to check something. Okay, I do have 2.75 times damage. That is definitely helping quite a bit. That enemy can absolutely suck my dick. Every single time, it just spawns on top of me. And I'm sure there was plenty of time to move out the way if I'd have just looked. But I shouldn't have to look underneath my player model. Spawn it somewhere fucking else. Shouldn't have to be looking under my player model to make sure, or like directly next to my player model to make sure I'm not going to walk into it. It shouldn't spawn there in the first place. It's bullshit that it can. Also, our big boy hasn't arrived yet. I'm not exactly sure where he is. Maybe it's like a random chance after so many kills or something. Don't know what this thing is. Star Splitter. Ooh, interesting. Hot lid. Let's see how this thing does in a room, shall we? Confusing, that's how. Very confusing. We need something with, like, infinite range. Looks like a pellet. So hard to hit things. This seems to be the best because it's got bouncy bullets, which helps a lot. But nothing, nothing beats the whip right now. The whip is the best. Because it can do that. <laughs> Just annihilate something sometimes. Okay, nice. We do have a, a thingy here. Mini boss. This guy got an update as well, I think. Okay, the... Corruption Bomb seems to do a lot of damage to him there. Or, or, or was it also that was doing a lot of damage? Okay, got him. <laughs> Wasn't entirely sure what was going on there. We got him. Not a lot of rewards for that guy, sadly. I 
like that, thank you. <laughs> I just love the way it just like goes crazy and then like part of it's now red as well. Basically, the reason it's doing that, I think, is because the way it works is each, like, the, the, the whip itself is made up of multiple different projectiles. And so each one of them has its own shadow bullet chance. Honestly, that wouldn't be a bad shout right now. I'm trying to buy it because I'm getting hit by the mix way too often, even though it's a bad item. I'd like to re-roll it, but completely implausible for us to do that. Oh god, I've got to use a club. Oh, fuck me. The fucking white guy scared the hell out of me. This is going to take forever and a day, isn't it? I mean, I've got so much extra damage with it, it shouldn't take too long, but proving to not be easy. Also, with this guy teleporting around all the time, can you just stay in one spot for a little bit, dude? Okay, we got him. Dude. Dude. Get out of here. Why does remote bullets not work with this thing? Table tech rage ain't bad. It ain't bad. See an enemy I don't like. Decide to insta kill it straight away. The natural progression of things. Getting to this chest is going to be slightly annoying because we're going to deal with this room, but. Actually, not that bad of a room when you can shoot through walls, is it? Oh, the sack disappeared right before. Apparently, the sacks don't blink anymore when they're about to disappear. I missed that. That was nice. Now they just actually just disappear. They just poof out of existence. Key. Have we been to the shop yet? We have, yeah. It was unfortunately not very good. Oh my goodness. You can't steal my whip, can you? No synergy. Just table tech money, which at this point in the run is fucking useless. Um... Honestly, not sure what to go for in terms of weaponry here. I'm going to try the Shredder and see how that goes, because it's kind of hard to miss this boss. I need to remember as well that these count as free blanks, essentially. It's not great. Let's go back to Sasha, maybe. Oh yeah, Sasha fucking destroys. Sasha's a god. Yeah, the corruption mob can be used as like free blanks as well. Alright, let's check down here real quick. Explosive birth? Do we have anything explosive? Apart from the shredder, no, not really. That's a bit of a shame. Can I bat us a reroll? No, I can bat to get rid of all my money again, though. God damn it. Just give me all my money back. Okay, we're out of here. Right, let's get gone. Last floor. And then on to the Advanced Dragon, which I'm sure will go perfectly fine. <laughs> uh, we've got so many guns, but honestly, so few of them are actually able to be properly used right now. It's kind of funny. That's just how Gungeon do be sometimes. It's how it do be.
hopefully the last floor doesn't take forever to load, like always. But it will. It will take its sweet, sweet time. And then, yeah. I don't know if we're going to die to the dragon, because we have quite a lot of HP. But it's still going to be a struggle bus. I think we're going to kill him reasonably quickly, just because we've got, um... Like, we're not going to be able to miss. We've got all that extra damage. Ooh, care shelter shot. Hell yes. Only on two cares, so that's certainly viable for us right now. With all this money, I'd uh, be happy for somewhere to spend it. Just gotta be a little careful here. Oh my god. Okay, that was close. Not too bad there, though. Right, what do you got for me? We've got needle bullets. And we've got yellow chamber. We did spawn a lot of the gems there, though. Um, do we have anything cursed we can drop? Uh, massively increased shot speed, bullets pierce all enemies. Um, nothing cursed that I want to drop. We could get rid of corruption bombs, I guess. Can I just corrupt a lot of the gem deal with him that way? That'd be really funny if that worked. Right, massively increased shot speed. Seems to have increased our fire rate quite a ton and made this thing into something even more hellish than it once was, which I, I kind of love. Like, it seems to be doing the bullet effect way more often. Which I certainly quite like. Oh, that was absolutely bollocks. Oh, my God. Oh, no, no, no. Losing all my money on you. Whoopsie. Bad losses there. That doesn't really help us at all. Right, unless the other chest is good. Yeah, I don't think I care about the other chest, I'll be honest. I just want to get into my shop, potentially buy some stuff. Did I lose more money? I thought I had 140 something. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get out of here, bitch. Oh, 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 there's Alpha and Omega bullets there. I'd like them both, please. Now, can you get away so I can get into the shop, please? Do some more rooms while we wait, I guess. Roll! Dude, I fucking... Ugh! So fucked off right now. I rolled and the game just fucking ate my input. Fuck off, you bearded cunt. I know you don't have a beard, but fuck you. I wanted you to have a beard so I could swear at you about beards. Ah, uh, so annoyed. Game just fucking ate my input. It's like, mm, you didn't roll. Yes, I fucking well did, you stupid bitch. God damn, I'm so annoyed. Like spikes in this game just happen at the worst possible times. Go away! Also, how can I keep doing rooms but I always have less money? <laughs> it's annoying the hell out of me. Also, I can't really see where the floor is here, so forgive me if I fall. Oh, 
Got them leg spikes. Nah. <laughs> In no way I'm doing that room. I wanted to get the Alpha and Omega bullets, but that wasn't going to happen, is it? Do you know what? This is definitely a room for this. I can't be asked even with all this bullshit. Got hit again. God. Damn it, he spawned an enemy on me! God damn it! I had enough. It was all coming together and I had enough. And then they spawned an enemy on top of me. Fuck you, game. <gasps> Junkin! No! I fell! Look how I've got Lord of the Pit. Junkin. In my time of need, you came to me. If only I hadn't given away all my junk. Really? Fuck off, Lord of the Gems. No one cares about you. Fuck these things in the ass. Really? Okay, I did manage to get that sack there. Okay, managed to get the alpha bullets at least. No omega bullets though. The damn shame. Right, Sasha. You've only got 15 bullets, Sasha? What the hell? Buy the full ammo. Oh. Okay, with this shot speed, it's so much harder to control our bullets. Also, this isn't doing nearly as much damage as I would have hoped. This didn't even close to go anywhere near how I wanted it to. I hear everything. We got to the advanced dragon stage at least. <laughs> That's something, I guess. Yeah, doesn't matter. <laughs> that was awful. I hated that in every sense of the word. Why did I do that to myself? God damn, this game makes me so angry sometimes. So angry. Like, nothing gets me quite as angry. Peglin gets close. This. Oh, god damn. Hate it sometimes. Fuck. Oh. Just the lag is so obnoxious. You're just chilling, fighting some shit, and then you press the roll button and it's like, soik! No roll for you. Not a single roll. Not a single input in this, like, almost a second long period is going to take effect and you're just going to get hit because fuck you that's why thanks game anyways anger aside i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one